kaiju universe is gone! I I'd like to say that I was lying, but uh, no. Uh, I literally made a video on this game yesterday and it no longer exists. It has been taken down. <laughs> uh, so this comes off the back of a couple of other kaiju universe kind of game, like Godzilla games on Roblox being taken down by D DMCA. Basically, um, I'm assuming Toho, who owns Godzilla, um, did not like that a third party, th or third parties on Roblox were making games without a license. In essence, they are kind of making money off another like license without actually giving any money to you know Godzilla. But basically, I was playing Kaiju Universe last night. I was leveling up my Shin Godzilla, and I was even gifted a thermal Godzilla. There, there you go. There it is. Uh, you've been given a gift from Jmind360. Uh, gift Thermo Nuclear. And I was going to make a video on that today. Uh, I was grinding my Shin Godzilla. I think I got up to level 86 according to that screenshot just down there. I've already put it on the screen. So this is an announcement from the creators of Kaiju Universe says, Hello everyone! It is with a heavy heart that I share some news with you today. Due to a DMCA request, we've had to take KU down. This is certainly not the outcome we hoped for, but it's not all bleak, which is interesting. They go on to say, on a brighter note, we were excited to announce that we are in the process of collaborating with some remarkable partners to secure an official license. More news on this soon. While we can't provide a specific timeline just yet, please know that we are doing everything in our power to relaunch the game. No player data has been lost and we're going to continue development. Your support has been incredible and we are deeply grateful for it. Uh, thank you for standing by us. Best regards, Verit, Zara, and the entire PG development team. What's interesting about this whole situation, it feels like where Jurassic was. The Jurassic franchise between Jurassic World was in a situation that, you know, there was no games, there was no movies coming out, and it just felt dead. Uh, and it feels like the Godzilla gaming franchise is in the same situation. Like the last game that came out, I think was the 2015 PS4 game. And that's it. So what does a collaboration look like? Well, I mean, the one that I know of is Gigabash. That's a game where you play as their own kaijus. Uh, I've never covered it, but I have played it before and I, I have meant to play it. I just never got around to it. Uh, maybe we'll do that now because we can't play anything else. <laughs> um, so yeah, but in there, you could only pick from, I think, three different monsters from the Godzilla universe. So the fact that KU had so many different kaijus means that in my opinion i get the feeling that when this comes back chances are the roster may be severely limited like i don't know that's just my like going off what previous collaborations have looked like it feels like that might be the case because let's be honest if a godzilla game came out that had all of the you know the kaijus that were in every godzilla and you could do free for alls battles and everything and it came out to a console or steam like a P pc or whatever it would make major money so i get where toho's coming from they're like you're making money from this and also this guy that gifted me you know the the thermonuclear he paid real money and i didn't even he, he wasted money because I didn't even get to try it. I didn't get to play it. It's like, God damn. Oh, dear. We've seen this in the Jurassic franchise. Remember? Like, we had the, the fan games, the Jurassic Park games. And the only way that they're ever going to see the light of day is if they just remove all Jurassic license. So maybe there's a workaround where they can, you know, oh, it's not Biollante, it's some other creature. But the thing is, there's no, like, they are the creatures. Like, there's no way, unless you change the entire model, that you're going to be able to uh, get around that. It's such a shame, because not even a month ago did I start playing this game. Uh, I, I don't want to say that maybe <laughs> my exposure to it, like, 
uh, making videos on it got a wider audience to see it, but might have also got Toho to see it. I don't know. I don't think so. I, I, if that's happened, I apologize because I, I really enjoyed it. But it seems to be the ending on an optimistic note. Like they are working to try and get a license. And I do wish the best for them. I, I want to play it. Of course I do. Um, but now if you go on Roblox and you type in Godzilla as of recording this video anyway, I don't know if everything gets resolved. Um, there's pretty much no Godzilla games. They've all gone. So there goes my uh, direction I was going to go in. <laughs> I was like, right, Jurassic's dead. There ain't anything happening at the moment except for like a new movie or whatever. Let's go Godzilla. Godzilla's been there. Godzilla's great. I love Godzilla. It's giant dinosaurs. It's all gone. <laughs> it's all god oh god and also the amount of people that you know played hours and hours and dedicated so much time to maxing out all the kaijus uh it's a shame that it has ended this way although they have went on record that no one saying that no one's progress has been lost like the game still exists and has probably got all of the saved data from everyone's accounts it just isn't live like, they cannot put it live without risking legal consequences from Toho. Uh, and, and that's pretty much all we have to work with. This is break, breaking news! Uh, the, the, the tea break, Mike, back again. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> but anyway, guys, uh, leave in the comments down below what do you think of this situation? What do you think any uh, resolutions could look like? Um, but I, in my personal opinion, I feel like if it does come back, it's going to be very limited. The roster is going to be incredibly squeezed down to maybe only a handful of kaijus that they're able, the Toho is going to give allowance to. But I genuinely really enjoyed Kaiju Universe. I love the models. I love the combat. The amount of effort that went in from the team to make these models, the animations and stuff. Uh, yes, the map wasn't the best, but the, the models and attacks and stuff were... I don't know. I was starting to get addicted to it, actually. <laughs> maybe maybe it's best to just take it out. I don't know. Maybe we'll play Gigabash now that we'll... You know, any way to play Godzilla. I don't know. But anyway, guys... If you've enjoyed this video and you've enjoyed my kaiju uh, content, I, you know, we're going to find other stuff to play. It's just a shame that this had to happen like right now when I was starting to get into the swing of things and I was going to record freaking two videos today on it. Anyway, if you enjoyed it, leave a like. Until next time. Well, I'll see you in a different game. Bye. <laughs>